got a new crankbait, the Axis crankbait, which you can pre-order right now and tackle. If you can walk us through the Axis crankbait and give us a little bit of information on that. Yeah, absolutely. This is a, a really unique style bait. Um, it kind of blends like a chatter bait and a crankbait. Of course, it comes in all the great colors that uh, Sixth Sense is known for, but the, the real unique part of this bait is that it comes in this free swinging metal lip design. Um, it's a bait that we came out with and we've been working on it for, it seems like forever. It's been probably three to four years in production that, that Casey, the owner of Sixth Sense, the designer, has been working on this bait to get it right and it finally was ready for the market, but now we're gonna kind of release it to the masses here shortly. So far, it's been a, a really incredible bait. Um, this free swinging lip gives it an action really that I've never seen before. It's a super wide erratic action. Of course, it has the sound when this 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 uh, blade is hitting the side of the crankbait. So you have a little bit different action, a little bit different sound than really anything that the fish are seeing. Dives three to five feet or so, so a shallower diving crankbait, but really awesome, awesome bait. Looks like you've been fishing a little bit, some line tied in that guy. You've been fishing it up where you're at right now? or? or yeah, man. So line tie on this is is directly to the bill. It's right in front of the bait right there. I don't know if you guys can see that very well. Like I said, we're kind of we're out here in nature doing some things. But yeah, that that line tie being right there really gives the bait. It, it almost hunts automatically on the retrieve, like one and a half feet or so side to side each each time you turn the handle. And then uh, we we've had some really good luck actually stopping the bait, giving it some hard rips, fishing like a jerk bait and stuff like that. Casey actually testing it caught a ten pounder in a tournament off a of bed using this bait. So it's a very versatile bait, cool shower and a crank bait. Wild, wild. Yeah, yeah. You know we've seen uh, uh, this whole week a lot of kind of unique new products uh, kind of combining two mm -hmm. two different categories together. And this is this is an exciting new one. I I can't wait to 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 try it out myself. Uh, is this something that's gonna really shine around grass, do you think? Yeah, so grass, you know, really any type of hard shallow cover. I've been fishing it a lot more around shallow riprap and uh, timber and stuff like that. But, you know, grass edges, anytime you have some holes or, or some big open areas in the grass, this bait really, really gets bit. I mean, it, like I said, the action is, is really what sets this bait apart. It's something the fish haven't seen. And as you guys know, when you give them something they haven't seen before, and you give it some hard erratic rips, you, you're, you're generally going to have a better chance of getting bit than the traditional square bowl that's been whizzing by their face all day. Have you guys, uh, Matt, have you guys had a chance to fish this bait at all yet, or, do you, or is it still new to you guys? Yeah, yeah taking it off mute, um, I've had them since the prototypes I had in January, and when I first look at it, it, it looks like nothing you've ever seen, a bendable bill on a crankbait. And then the first, I remember I first put it in the canal at Toho when I was down there fishing the open in January. And the erratic action, how it comes back true, it still hunts. I mean, like he said, it was a foot and a half out of, you know, the normal range to come straight in line back to you. And then to come back true, uh, yeah, all the time I think fish see that same wobble action in a crankbait presentation. And to give them something totally different that is uh, – is nothing like they've seen before is huge. Whether you're Gunnersville, Smith, or up here fishing for smallmouth, uh, I think it's going to be it, it, it's going to be a killer uh, when when it you know it's selling out as fast as they can get them in. It's been an academy, and I think they're going to continue to get them in, and it, it's going to be a a killer for sure. Very cool. So before we get in the next bait, it looks like we have some other new crankbait colors. Uh, from Six Cents. And again, you can pre-order the Staxis right now, and also you can pre-order these new colors. Do you have some of the new colors there with you, uh, Ben? Yeah, man. Um, got a couple of them. Just a second. Let me grab those colors out. But um, I think we have some. If you go cut to the camera here while you're doing that. No? Yeah, if you cut to the main camera here, here's some of the new colors we got you guys can see. Oh, wow. A lot of bluegill kind of sunfish looking colors. Yeah, we got some some new, more bright bluegill colors. Um, probably doesn't mean much to you guys, but we went out cranking with one. Um, uh, it's called Mud. What is it? Mudgill. It was just a first day out. We took out of the package. We won our tournament with you know 20 boats with 22 pound limit on that bait exclusively. It's a freaking killer for muddy water. Um, and then yeah, a couple couple more bluegill colors, a couple of shad colors, but always coming out with new stuff. So you guys are probably looking at pictures of them on there that look a, a little prettier than anything I can tell you. 
Yeah, no, some, some beautiful colors and, and always great finishes from Sixth Sense. Uh, again, those are available to pre-order on the site now.